What's up guys, in this video, we're breaking down the 5 best AV receivers in 2022. I've made this list based on sound quality, comfortability, and more. I've included options for every type of consumer, so whether you're looking for an inexpensive option that's good for smaller rooms, or the best, most powerful model available, we'll have the AV receiver for you. If you want more information and the most up-to-date pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description below. Okay, so let's get started with the video. If you're looking for an AV receiver that's easy to use, compact, and still offers solid sound quality without breaking the bank, the Sony STR-DH590 is a great inexpensive option for you to consider. The Sony STR-DH590 is an inexpensive AV receiver that offers a lot of useful features typically found on more expensive models, respectable sound, and 4K pass-through to improve your home theater setup. It has a minimalistic design that won't draw much attention, large knobs to control the input selection and master volume, a front panel with legible text, and a relatively thin design that should fit into tighter spaces. On the back, it comes with four HDMI inputs and one HDMI output, which is less than some competitors like the Yamaha RX A2A, but it supports 4K pass-through to deliver a crystal clear image and several HDR formats, including HDR10, HLG, and Dolby Vision. Unfortunately, it lacks networking features such as Apple AirPlay, Chromecast, or built-in Spotify, but it has a reliable Bluetooth 4.2 connection and can be used as a speaker for music. It delivers 145 watts RMS of power, which should be enough to fill small home theater rooms with sound, and it utilizes Sony's Pure Direct mode to produce clean, clear audio when listening to music or watching content, though the quality isn't as high-end as the Marantz NR1711. You get five distinct channels for greater placement flexibility, and it supports several surround sound formats to broaden the soundscape and deliver a more immersive viewing experience. I also like that it comes with acoustic calibration circuitry, so you can quickly and easily tune your speaker levels to the room. While it doesn't sound as full-bodied or detailed as more expensive options like the Marantz NR1711, the Sony STR-DH590 is a solid option that produces crystal clear images with your favorite content, solid sound, and an intuitive setup process for a fraction of the price. If you're looking for an AV receiver that can fit into most full-fledged home theater systems and provide a solid experience for casual viewers, this might be the ideal addition to your setup. Next up, we have an AV receiver with an impressive amount of audio and video options to provide greater control, high-resolution sound, and several connectivity options. The Yamaha Aventage RX A2A is a great addition to most home theater setups. Not everyone has thousands of dollars to spend on a high-quality AV receiver, and the Yamaha RX A2A is a solid mid-range option that comes with several different modes to optimize your audio, advanced video format support, and several useful modern features at a decent price. It comes with a reflective front panel that features a large central knob to control the volume or select inputs and large legible text on the right-hand side. Unlike previous models, it lacks a cover flap to conceal the inputs, but it offers several connectivity options for your other devices, including seven HDMI inputs, an eARC compatible input, a 6.3 millimeter headphone jack for private listening, a USB-A port to stream media locally or charge devices, and a mini jack for mics. Even more, it also offers support for AirPlay, Alexa, and Google Assistant, Bluetooth, and music playback from Spotify and Deezer. It's compatible with Yamaha's useful MusicCast app, which allows you to stream high-resolution audio formats such as Apple Lossless, Wave, and more. Overall, the sound is impressive and more precise than the Sony STR-DH590, with a powerful low-end response that adds some rumble to music or movies, a rich mid-range for dialogue, and treble that doesn't sound too harsh, though it lacks the power of options like the Denon AVR-X3700H. It also offers display stream compression technology to support 4K video at 120Hz and 8K at 60Hz, along with an auto low latency mode and VRR for gamers, DTSX and Atmos audio, and HDR10 Plus and Dolby Vision support. The Yamaha RX A2A is a solid mid-range option that offers plenty of connectivity options, support for a wide range of formats, and superior audio and picture quality to the STR-DH590. This is an ideal receiver for more serious users or home theater setups, and it's perfect if you want greater control over your viewing experience without sacrificing clarity or quality of life features. Some users might be looking for an AV receiver that supports most formats and can reliably fill smaller rooms with high quality sound. The Marantz NR1711 is a great AV receiver that excels in smaller spaces. Marantz has a few premium offerings to choose from, and the Marantz NR1711 comes with a low-profile design that can fit into almost any home entertainment system without sacrificing performance, solid video upscaling, and well-balanced audio. 
The compact design allows for greater placement flexibility, and it has two large knobs on the front to control the volume or input, a USB port to charge your other devices, and several buttons to enable certain features or sound modes. Unfortunately, it only has a single HDMI output, but it supports 8K at 60Hz or 4K at 120Hz video signals, offers an HDMI input for pass-through, and can upscale video from the non-8K compatible ports to improve your viewing experience. Even more, it has built-in Wi-Fi to stream your favorite content, Alexa and Google Assistant voice commands, Apple AirPlay 2, Bluetooth, and the HEOS companion app to adjust settings, control playback, and more. It has seven audio channels with 50 watts of power per channel, which should be adequate for smaller living rooms, bedrooms, or dens, along with an Odyssey speaker calibration feature to optimize the sound based on your acoustic environment and dynamic volume to keep levels stable. Overall, it delivers a clear, detailed, vibrant soundstage that excels with several types of audio, including music and movies, and it supports nearly every modern HDR format to further improve the picture quality. I also like that it has a dynamic EQ function that improves the dialogue, low-end response, and surround sound channel levels to provide a better, more detailed viewing experience. While it doesn't quite offer the power of the Denon AVR X3700H, the audio quality is somewhat comparable, and anything more powerful than the Marantz NR1711 is likely overkill in smaller rooms. I would recommend this for anyone who values high-quality audio and video, advanced connectivity options, and doesn't have a large viewing space to fill the sound. Now for anyone that's looking for an AV receiver that excels in nearly any situation and consistently delivers a crystal clear, detailed image, the Denon AVR X3700H is my choice as the best AV receiver for most people in 2022. Denon's AVR X3700H AV receiver is a versatile option that offers a wide selection of ports, comprehensive HDR support, and comparable performance to premium options for a much lower price, which makes it ideal for almost any home theater setup. It comes with seven total inputs to connect your additional home theater components, and it has one input and two outputs that support HDMI 2.1, 8K video at 60 Hz, and 4K at 120 Hz, which is more than the Marantz NR1711. Each port also supports quick media switching to instantly adjust the resolution or frame rate for smoother overall performance. Like the NR1711, it's compatible with the HEOS app to activate Alexa, Google Assistant, or Siri voice commands, enable multi-room functionality, and utilize AirPlay 2 connectivity. Even more, it comes with an exceptionally durable build, so you can be sure it's a solid long-term investment. It's capable of 11.2 channel processing, which provides greater flexibility when setting up your system, and it comes with a useful on-screen assistant and Odyssey Multi-IQ to accurately fine-tune the sound to your space. While it doesn't offer the same crystal clear sound as the Marantz SR8015, it offers Dolby Atmos height virtualization for 3D sound and still produces more balanced, detailed, and dynamic audio than the previously mentioned options, which makes it appropriate for audiophiles or serious setups. You also get support for most major HDR formats to boost the contrast, color saturation, and motion processing. The Denon AVR X3700H is the best AV receiver for most people because of its intuitive setup process, wide-ranging support for audio and video formats, and more detailed sound than less expensive options, which makes it ideal for almost any listening or viewing requirement. This is an ideal choice if you want high-quality audio, crystal-clear video, and several convenient modern features. If you're looking for the AV receiver with the best mixture of sound quality, video support, volume output, and all-around performance, the Marantz SR8015 is my choice as the best overall AV receiver in 2022. Next up, we have the Premium SR8015, which is a high-end AV receiver that offers an outstanding maximum volume, 11 amplifier channels to accommodate most arrangements, and class-leading audio. It comes with a sturdy, robust build that can withstand heavy-duty usage over time, although it's much larger and heavier than other options like the Marantz NR1711 to house the powerful internal components. On the front, you get a small screen that displays the selected input and volume levels, along with a larger, fold-down rectangular display that shows more detailed information. It offers a wide range of HDMI inputs for connectivity, including an input that supports advanced 8K at 60 Hz video, 8 analog stereo ports, and 2 optical digital audio inputs, along with built-in Bluetooth connectivity for wireless streaming or private listening. While it's much more expensive than the previously mentioned options, you pay for performance, and it delivers an output of 140 watts to each channel, which should be suitable for medium to large rooms and most speaker arrangements. It also has 11 amplifier channels to accommodate a variety of speaker setups for greater versatility, directivity, and depth. 
Overall, it delivers class-leading, well-balanced audio and near-perfect surround performance, which offers an exceptionally accurate stereo image, support for newer formats like IMAX enhanced audio, and an immersive all-around experience. The Marantz SR8015 is the best overall AV receiver because of its outstanding versatility, enough power to reliably fill larger spaces, and superior audio and video quality to the Denon AVR-X3700H. If you're an audiophile or have a serious home theater setup and want an AV receiver that offers exceptional overall performance with every type of content, this might be the ideal addition to your rig. Links to updated pricing on all products mentioned in the video are in the description below. If you liked this video and it helped you out in any way, please give the video a like and hit that subscribe button. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Till next time, I'll see you later.